Hi, my name is Dave from Sync Technologies, and we're going to talk about the advantages and disadvantages of fixing your Xbox yourself versus a local company fixing your Xbox or sending it to Microsoft. First off, fixing an Xbox yourself is something not for any novice person when it comes to electronics. I don't recommend it. Uh, you can actually cause more problems, even a fire, if you do it wrong. But if you are confident that you can do it, you can search out on the net and get the parts that you need to actually repair your own Xbox. Um, it is time consuming, especially your first time through. So that would be one disadvantage for doing it yourself, besides actually burning up your Xbox 360. Um, second, your local service center uh, has a few more advantages than the other two options that you have. Uh, your local service center, it might cost you a little more money to get it done. You will have a local warranty, which means if anything goes wrong, you can take it right back to them. Uh, they can do customizations usually, uh, where Xbox or Microsoft will not do a uh, customization to your Xbox. Uh, and length of time in for service. Uh, generally, if you're doing it yourself, it's going to take a long time. Your Xbox is going to be down because you haven't worked on it before. If you send it off to Microsoft, you're going to be without your Xbox for at least six weeks. Sometimes a whole lot longer than that. I've heard as long as four months. Um, so there's advantages to Microsoft too because it's still under warranty. It's not going to cost you anything except for shipping. Um, and you're guaranteed a working unit coming back or at least a replacement of that unit. Uh, with the local company, uh, if it is unfixable, you're done because you've already voided the warranty because it's not Microsoft working on it. They will have to void the warranty tag on it to open it up. Um, but I personally would rather go to a local company that way if something goes wrong I can go have somebody I can actually talk to about it instead of contacting Microsoft and getting the 50th wrong person.